Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, this is Mythic, and I'm going to be teaching you guys today how to get rid of the error that you get when you try to run some applications where it says uh, this or this application cannot run because it requires uh, like .NET frame and then uh, DLLv4 point whatever. Uh, I'm going to teach you guys how to get rid of that error and how to fix that and all all that good stuff and uh, how it works. So uh, I'm just going to get rid of that and let's start. So there's two things you're going to need first off. You're going to need to uh, first go to this link. I'll have both of them in the description. Uh, it's howtogeek.com, whatever. Uh, it's called Take Ownership, so you're just going to download that, and then it's a simple install. And then you're going to go into the computer, uh, Windows, and then if you have it, the this right here, the SYS uh, WOW 64. Now you're going to... I think this is, yeah. You're going to go up here and search for uh, MS, or MS uh, Core. I'm pretty sure it's like this. Yes, like that. Uh, so MS uh, Cor, and it's going to be this one right here. Actually, yours is going to be uh, MS, uh, MS Core E and then .dll. So it'll look like this one right up here. But uh, you're going to go, and then uh, I've already done this, so uh, I'm just teaching you guys how you would do it to when you haven't done it yet. So you're gonna, you are going to click the one that you have, and you have to make sure it's the C slash Windows slash uh, this one, uh, whatever, SYS, WOW64, and not that one up there. Uh, so y you would right click and then once you have that own take ownership thing, you're going to take ownership, click yes, and then now you can rename the file. So I'm just going to uh, click um, open file location so it's easier. So now you're going to rename it and uh, you're, gonna, you're just going to rename it to... Like I, I made mine MS Corey one. Uh and then you're gonna go to the second website that I provide in the description. And then you're gonna come down here and you're gonna download the zip file. Once you download the zip file, you're gonna locate it in your uh downloads folder. So let's just open this downloads. And then you're gonna go into the MS score. And you're just going to drag in and drop that in there. But I've already done that, so I'm not going to... Or I guess I could do it again. Uh, move and replace. Continue. And uh, you need permission. Okay, well, you won't get that error. I'm only getting it because I've already done this. But uh, you will not get that error. You're just going to drag and drop that in there. And it will, it should work now because I couldn't run my game booster without it, and now I can. So, if you guys, uh, if this worked for you, good. I hope you guys like that. If you uh, are having any problems, please let me know in the comments, and I will get back to you and try to help you as best as 